Hello basketball coaches and basketball players, my name is Alan from Al's Basketball Training and today I'm going to show you some basketball plays that you can run at a very young age like U7 or U8 that will help your team spread out so that you can be able to run the court a lot better and score a lot easier. Hello basketball coaches and basketball players, my name is Alan from Al's Basketball Training. If you're new to this channel, on this channel I show you basketball plays, drills, and skills. So if you like that stuff, hit the like button and subscribe. But anyways, I'm going to show you today some amazing, simple, easy basketball plays that will help your team learn how to spread out and be able to score a lot easier because they're spread out and not all clumped together in one big massive ball of kids on the basketball court okay so here we are down on the clipboard and basically we're going to start with a very simple box offense where we're going to have the bigger players starting up top and then we're going to have the shorter players starting in the low block basically what we're teaching here is screening as well as still spreading out so these players are going to be setting a screen down and then these players are going to be popping up so it's going to look like this and now one of these two players should be open for the pass. So let's say player two is open. Now he can look at player five in the post for player five to post up and score. Now this could be a three-point line. This could also be at the mid-range line because both of these players may be open for a shot as well. But now when you're explaining this to your players on the court, you can say, see, look how spread out you are. It makes it a lot easier to score because now the defense is not all clumped together in one spot being able to defend just an area instead of having to defend now the full court. And then you can explain to them allowing you to score easier is important because when you're easier to score you can score more points which will allow you to win more games and everybody wants to win more games. Now you can run another box offense as well. Now this one, instead of screening down, instead of that, you're gonna be screening across. And this is gonna be the same idea where now these players are screening across. Player two is gonna go out to the three-point line or mid-range line, or mid-range area. Free throw line extended anyways. And then player five is gonna go down to the post. Player one can then pass to player two and player two could shoot or you could pass to player five who could shoot and now you've got two rebounders who are ready to rebound the other option over here is now player three could then roll off and the ball could go to this side as well and player four may be open in the post as well for the easy layup now another play i like to run is to, te to teach my team how to spread out is the five out. Now I have posted this before about the five out and the reason is look how spread out they are. If they're running their positions there's no way that they will be all clumped together like you see a lot of y young sports teams like. So basically running a five out very simple you can either pass and screen away or pass and screen four and that's just very simple now you're teaching passing and screening and rolling now he may be open in the post if not because he came from this side he can go and fill out like this so when you come from a particular side that player needs to then fill that spot it's just cut and fill and because he was rolling it's just filling back out and now again they're still spread out now to teach the five out, you can also use a three on three offense and that's going to be very simple. Again, you can have your team run three on three in practice and still know what to do when there's five players on the court. The reason is because it's the same motions. Player two passes to player one, screens for player one, and that's going to be a screen and roll. Now because he's coming back out to this side, he needs to fill that spot again. Player one passes to player three, and that's going to be a screen and roll. He's going to pop back out, and you're just going to continue on like that. Now, when your coach says shoot, then when that when that pass and screen and roll happens, they're going to either shoot from here or they're going to pass the player three rolling towards the basket for an easy shot. Now, it's going to be the same as the five out, so that's how I like to teach the five out.
Anyways, I hope that you have enjoyed today's video. If you have, hit that like button and subscribe. I hope that these basketball plays help you and your very young basketball team. Hopefully they get to spread the court a little bit more. And hopefully you guys get to score and win a lot more as well. Anyways, I do post new videos every single day. So if you like these basketball plays, drills, and skills videos, hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys again tomorrow. Basically, through Skype, I can train with you one-on-one -on -one or one-on-a-group, one or the other. So if you are interested in that, click the link in the description. It's called Online Basketball Training. Basically, we'll be using Skype to be able to train with you. All you need to do is have a set of wireless headphones, a cell phone, tablet, or laptop with a webcam, and we are able to train one-on-one. -on -one. All you need to do is take it to your local gym, as long as they have Wi-Fi, or to the park, or you can do it in your backyard, and we can I can help you become a better basketball player. Hello, so if you have liked this video, click over here to subscribe, or maybe over here, depending on which side I put it on, I don't know yet. Anyways, uh, also the opposite direction or the opposite side is another video you may like. So I hope to see you again in one of those next videos. Yeah.